video, but I found a top search engine related to Voyager with one. Uh, main question is, how is Voyager 1 still working? Well, it worked for such a long time because of crazy engineering. Basically, the, the bits and bytes of each of the components of Voyager 1 were literally were actual bites. Like, I think they are about the size of a trash can. A small one, of course. But I... All of those are the memory. And those are very resistant to cosmic radiation. And the cosmic radiation, of course, is a big problem in interstellar space. I believe it's like near the heliopause, I believe. Uh, the edge of the sun's magnetic field protecting us from interstellar radiation. However, it actually stopped working, according to the Jet Propul Jet Propulsion Laboratory uh, of NASA on November 14th, 2023. Because one chip, one of those uh, things that you call a CPU, a single chip, it actually stopped working because the software kind of just bugged out probably because of the cosmic radiation. So, the Voyager 1 is several light days away from us. So, while NASA was figuring that out, they sent a tiny bit of data because the tiny because the physical bits and bytes could not handle more than that. They sent tiny little bits and bytes to Voyager 1 and after a while it eventually stopped. It eventually continued to work and transmit data and images. So, in short, Voyager 1 is still working because of some crazy electronics.